Yo, what's up world? It's your boy Filosco here and today we're going to learn some serious, serious English. Now I know most of the times I may be silly and I do things like Whatever! Shut your face! Now I know there's people out there who are already pretty good at speaking English and they want to perfect their English speaking skills. Well, this video right here will definitely help you. I was sent this poem by a fan of mine some time ago and I just ran across it as in I saw it again and I read it again and I think it's definitely time for me to read this poem to you. Now, the poem is in your description. You can see it, you know, when you look below the video. And as I read this poem, I want you to read the description and pay attention to the way I pronounce the words. A lot of the words are very similar but pronounced completely different. It is insane, okay? And some of you will be able to see the poem on the screen as I'm reading it, but some of you will have to read the description as I read it. So, let's get to it. Here's the poem. Dearest creature in creation, studying English pronunciation. I will keep you, Susie, busy. Make your head with heat grow dizzy. Tear in your eye, your dress you'll tear. So shall I. Oh, hear my prayer. Pray, console your loving poet. Make my coat look new, dear, sew it. Just compare heart, beard, and herd. Dyes and diet, lord and word. Sword and sward, retain and Britain. Mind the latter, how it's written. Made has not the sound of bad. Say said, pay paid, laid, but plaid. Now I surely will not plague you, with such words as vague as ague. But be careful how you speak. Say break, stake, but bleak and streak. Previous, precious, fuchsia, via. Pipe, snipe, recipe, and choir. Cloven, oven, how, and low. Script, receipt, shoe, poem, toe. Hear me say, devoid of trickery. Daughter, laughter, and terpsichore. Typhoid, measles, topsails, isles. Exiles, similes, reviles. Holy, holly, signal, signing. Thames, examining, combining. Scholar, vicar, and cigar. Sola, mica, war, and far. From desire, desirable, admirable, from admire. Lumber, Plumber, Bia, but Briar. Chatham, Broom, Renown, but Known. Knowledge, Done, but Gone, and Tone. One, Anemone, Balmoral. Kitchen, Lichen, Laundry, Laurel. Gertrude, German, Wind, and Mine. Seen, Malfemony, Mankind. Tortoise, Turquoise, Chammy Leather. Reading, Reading, Heathen Heather. The phonetic labyrinth gives moss, gross, brook, brooch, ninth, plinth. Billet does not end like ballet. Bouquet, wallet, mallet, chalet. Blood and flood are not like food, nor is mold like should and would. Banquet is not nearly parquet, which is said to rhyme with darkay. Vicious thy count, load and broad, toward to forward to reward. And your pronunciation's okay when you say correctly, croquet. Rounded, wounded, grieve and sieve. Friend and fiend, alive and live. Liberty, library, heave and heaven. Rachel, eighth, mustache, eleven. We say haloed, but allowed. People, leopard, toad, but vowed. Mark the difference, moreover, between mover, plover, and dover. Leeches, breeches, wise, precise. Chalice, but police, and lice. Camel, constable, unstable. Principal, disciple, label. Pedal, Penal and canal. Wait, surmise, plate, promise, pal. Suit, sweet, 
ruin circuit conduit rhyme with shirk it and beyond it but it is not hard to tell why it is Paul Mall but Pal Mal muscle muscular jail iron timber climber bullion lion worm and storm shaz chaos and chair senator spectator mayor ivy privy famous clamor and enamor rhyme with hammer pussy hussy and possess desert but desert address golf wolf countenance lieutenants hoist and lua flags left pennants river rival tomb bomb comb doll and roll and some and home stranger does not rhyme with anger yes it does neither does devour with clangor now that's half of the poem I think that's all you need for today but what I want you to do is to read this poem again by yourself and I want you to try to pronounce all the words properly and if you can of course listen to me say it again and try to memorize how these words are pronounced and even better yet try to memorize a poem because one day I may have a competition to see who can read the whole poem without making any mistakes so if I have this competition you will be in it if you can remember it so that's the end of the episode for today I hope you liked it I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you learned new stuff um, I'll make part two tomorrow or the day after there's a whole lot more words that are similar and Jesus Christ alright see you then Later.